today I'm going to make deep, sweet, passionate love. To an organic mango from Haiti. Welcome back to the original fast food review. I'm John with a J. And today, like I said, we're gonna get into this thing. We're not even gonna waste any time. We're just gonna grab the knife. I have no cutting board, please. Folks, do not try this at home. Uh, the car is parked, as always, this time in my driveway. Last time we did a mango, it was a red mango. It had a wonderful um, array of different colors sprayed on the surface. This one's pretty much a greenish yellow. Almost looks like an unripe banana. And you can see the ingredient label there. It does say from Haiti. It does say certified USDA organic. Now, the only thing I'm not super excited about <clears throat> is that it's come a long way. I'm interested to see what a Haitian mango tastes like. I don't think I've ever had one. If I have, it was... I didn't know I was having one. But it looks familiar. Um, it looks like a variety here that it could easily get in Florida, uh, which kind of perplexes me a little bit. Uh, there were no s options for a Floridian mango uh, in, I think, any of the grocery stores that we frequented this weekend. It's like mango season, dude. So, like, I don't know if it has to do with the money, money, money partnerships and all that crappy jazz uh, but I'd like to see some more Florida options uh, I could actively seek them out we weren't looking for mangoes we only usually buy one at a time and then we share it uh, she's not here so I'm going to only have to eat a very small sliver of this uh, but let's uh, let's get into it I'm going to cut away from myself with the blade try to skim it along the surface of the inner seed there we go that should that should probably suffice feel good about that oh lots of juice spilling out on the knife whoa oh here's the reveal folks are we ready in three i'm gonna slide it off two without dropping it fun oh my gosh nectar abounds it's gonna drip all over the car i have a feeling so i'll do this Give you the boop boop. Boop, boop 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 boom yeah that that feels good you want to eat the fruits close to home because and i'll put the rest of this back in its package because that's what's going to be most beneficial for you you know it's going to help you with the pollens and my look my nose is drip drip drippity today so will there be any I'm doing the score thing vertical score and then I'm gonna do the horizontal slicey dicey so yeah eat fruits and vegetables close to home that's the pollinators are doing their job your job is to soak up the goodness that they provided in the plants so that you build up immunities so it's locally blossoming in abundance and maybe it's a little too much for your system to handle mm. oh yeah oh yeah i should show you the the pop let's let's get the pop boom there it is there's the mango pop the mango it looks like a grenade of love <laughs> this is gonna be great look at that so pretty sun hitting it i better hurry up though before the sun bakes my phone and shuts off our broadcast so let's make sweet love to the mango organic mango from haiti <laughs> oh yeah i'm just diving in guys mm. go buy a mango go find a mango tree i have two small ones in the backyard it's gonna take a while for it to bear fruit but Grow a tree. Grow some fruit trees. Plant some seeds. Do some YouTube searches, some Google searches. See how to germinate the seed. 
what kind of soil certain fruit trees need. Ah, oh, it's so good. Man. Ah. Mmm. Ah, oh, I'm gonna mess it with it. Mmm, I'm gonna suck it on the skin. Yeah. Ah, oh, this is what they do on those fast food other channels, right? <laughs> the ones that millions of people are watching because we want to watch you eat food that's gonna kill us. Because that's what we need to watch, and that's what we need to eat, and that's what needs to make us hungry. Eat a mango, damn it! Put down the cheeseburger and pick up the damn mango! <laughs> Why am I yelling? Nature's fastest of fast foods, folks. Come on. Oh, gosh. It's going to be really hard to save the rest of that for my partner, but I got to do my duty. She's going to enjoy the heck out of this. Wow, what a treat. Mmm, 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 mmm. Ain't no lie. Baby, bye, bye, bye. So good, so good, so good. Look, folks, get some seeds plant some trees even if get some permission from your landlord even if you're not going to be there for an extended period of time two three six years however long it takes for a tree to fruit it's a gift to the next occupants it's a thank you to the folks that allowed you to stay in their home and pay rent and give you a safe creative space to be you to thrive to have shelter um, just get permission if you're a renter if if not Grow some fruit trees in some pots. If, if you're not into fruit, grow some herbs and vegetables. It's so awesome to connect with your food, to get into your food, to communicate with the plants, just to listen, because they'll tell you. This isn't one of those woo-woo things. You know, you might have heard this growing up. Listen to the plants, they'll talk to you. You know, name your plants, talk to your plants, and you're like, okay, crazy old person, whatever. It's true. The plants will talk to you. Just listen. From my heart to yours, I'm John with a J. Until we meet again on another original fast food review. Be good to each other. Be good to yourselves. Get under the sun. Go to a farm. Plant some trees. Drop the cheeseburger. Hoist the mango. I like to rhyme, but it usually doesn't happen until after the damn video. Maybe there'll be a rhyme below. All right, folks. We'll see you soon. Boo! We out.